Hello, Anime Expo fans. We are so excited today to be celebrating the 35th anniversary of Bub and all things Puzzle Bubble today. We've got some great panelists lined up for you, including folks from the Taito side, as well as Servios, uh, game creators behind the recent Puzzle Bubble VR Vacation Odyssey and the upcoming Puzzle Bubble 3D on PlayStation. And at the very end of today's panel, we have a special performance um, from some people that fans of Puzzle Bobble will recognize. But first up, I want to introduce our panelist. From Taito, we have... Hello everyone. Bubble Bobble, Puzzle Bobble, and Bubble is a promotion director of Bubble, and I'm a fan of Bubble. Bubble is a fan of Bubble, and I'm a fan of Bubble. バブルンチャンネルというYouTubeチャンネルを現在運営しているんですけど、その動画で出てくるタイトー忍者は実は私です。今日はよろしくお願いします。はい、タイトーサウンドチーム、ズンタタの石川和久です。今回のね、パズル
発射するといったところも他のパズルとは違った特徴になっていました。また、直接狙う壁に反射してボールを狙った場所に入れるといったビリヤード的なテクニックも持ち物パズルにはない特徴となっていました。もともとはアーケードゲームとして作られたパズルボブルなんですけれども、その後、家庭用、ガラケー、スマホ、絵とプラットフォームを広げていって、それに合わせて表現や操作方法もどんどん変化していきました。現在 VR が一般に広がっていく中で、今回のパズルボブル VR を出すことができて、とても嬉しく思っています。うん、すごく嬉しいよ。Okay, so every game is different, but There are some, some key ingredients that we see in most of the, the, the Puzzle Bobble classics. Can you tell us what these key ingredients are that make a really great Puzzle Bobble game? Game say, visual, sound, no, three yos, that to, moimas. As a game say, to say, wa, so, sa, no, sba, ya, sa, ga, to, wale, action, say, to, kiss, jun, ban, o, kan, ga, e, te, pin, point, de, wabble, o, ne, da, u, to, yu, e, si, ko, se, no, ba, nan, sa, ga, ji, yo, ni, na, te, ma, ste, 各シリーズごとに想定するお客様によってそのバランスを変えています。ビジュアルについては近年開発したパズルボブルのデザイナーを担当している大平さんからは昔からあるパズルボブルとしての世界観を大切にし,てしつつその時代のデザインに合わせた可愛いを重視してバランスを取ったデザインを目指していると聞いています。実際、バブルのデザイン自体もその時代に合わせてどんどん変化しているんですけれども、常にたくさんの人に愛されるポップさと可愛さを持ち続けているのが大事な要素となっています。そしてですね、えー、とサウンドのことを言いますと、まあ、聞いてるとハッピーになれるような BGM、そして、ね、歯切れのいい、えー、爽快感のある効果音っていうのがパズルボブルの、えー、サウンドの特徴と言えるんじゃないでしょうかね。そして、特にシリーズ共通のメインテーマであります、パオパオ島へ行こうっていう曲があるんですけど、これは様々なアレンジをされて、今も使われ続けている曲です。まあ、そのね、曲の作曲者である、えー、タイトサウンドチーム、ズンタタのカルさん。えー、まさかここ,こまでね、長く愛される曲になるとは、多分、彼女も思っていなかったと思いますよ。もちろんね、今回の VR 版でも、えー、このパオパオ島へ行こうはアレンジされて使われています。Thank you guys so much. We'll,、uh, we'll uh, come back to you here because、uh, hopefully we're going to have some time for some fan questions from the Servios and Taito Twitter. But now I want to turn things over to the folks at Servios to talk a little bit about Puzzle Bobble VR and、uh, Puzzle Bobble 3D. So, what is Puzzle Bobble 3D? Yeah, sure. Hey, Jonah, it's great to be here with everybody. Puzzle Bobble 3D is an extension of our Puzzle Bobble VR game. So, our goal is to give access to all of our amazing fans who maybe have a PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 5.、Uh, so, non VR players can enjoy this game, give everyone a chance to celebrate the 35th anniversary and Bub's birthday next month. Nice, nice. So, you know, we talked a little bit with the folks from Taito about this being a legendary franchise, which, you know, seems like a lot of pressure. But what can you tell us about developing a game like this in partnership with Taito? Yeah, for sure. I appreciate the trust that we have with Taito, and their collaboration with us has been truly amazing. It's what I love about working on licensed products the opportunity to bring the world into fans' homes that is not only fun and engaging, but authentic to the brand. So, a large part of what I do is ensuring that authenticity is properly represented and respected. That sounds great.、Um, so, I, I know some stars are, can be difficult to work with. What about working with Bub? Was he particular about how he looked in VR and 3D? First, Sabio さんからモデルが届いたときに、バブルの姿に十分感動したんですけど、僕はマジで。もうこんな風にもういやいや僕はもっと可愛いよってねバブルがこんな風にすごいダダをこねるんでもうサビオさんにギリギリまで何度も調整をしていただきました特にこの目の部分ですね目の部分は表情や雰囲気が大きく変わってくる部分ですのでとても細かい調整をしてもらっていますうんうんその結果ユーザーの皆様からも SNS で可愛いと言ってもらえたりととてもいい 3D のバブルを誕生させることができたと思っています。そうだね。VR では自分自身がバブルになるので、パズルボブルの世界に入り込むと目の前にいるのは、ちょっとね、バブルの、じゃなくてボブルになるんですけれど
、目の前でボブルンが生き生き動いているっていうこの感覚はもう VR ならではだなと思うのでぜひ体験してほしいです。VR では君が僕になるから僕の顔は見えないけどボブルンよりもかっこよくなってるはずだよ。Got it. So Matt, I know, I know you've actually got an interesting story、um, and your connection to the franchise. So, you know, what can you tell us about what you think fans of the original Puzzle Bobble and Bust a Move games can look forward to、uh, about Puzzle Bobble 3D? I'm happy to talk about that. So, you alluded to it, but I actually have a weird background in the video game industry. I grew up in the arcade game industry.、Um, my family's business here in LA for 50 years or longer, even, was. A distributorship of coin operated amusements. So,、um, buying amazing arcade machines from companies like Taito and selling them to people who operated arcades or movie theaters or what have you. And so, I've been playing Bubble Bobble my whole, my whole life, and I have nothing but reverence for these characters. And Bust a Move and Puzzle Bobble are some of my absolute favorite games of all time. So, very, very excited to be able to contribute in some small way to this legendary、um, golden era franchise. Uh, I think anyone who played the original Bust a Move or Puzzle Bobble is going to absolutely love this. We did a lot of work as a team to stay true to the original game, but we've completely evolved it, brought it into 3D, brought it into VR, and there is a bunch that's new and unexpected for fans of the classic to dig into here, but it's still very, very much Puzzle Bobble at its core. Well, that, that leads me to, a, to another question. What So, you talked a little bit about you know, understanding the original gameplay. How do the 3D and VR aspects of, of the game design enhance the overall Puzzle Bobble experience for fans? Absolutely. It, it changes it more than you think. So, at its core, the game is still fundamentally about what Puzzle Bobble has always been about, which is matching colors, firing bubbles at a game board, and popping those bubbles as quickly as you can, right? But, Putting it in 3D changes things completely because now instead of the game being on a 2D flat plane, you're firing at masses of bubbles that actually exist in 3D space with depth. So sometimes you'll see a match in front of you and you'll take your shot. And actually, when you impact the board, the whole board rotates and it's all physicalized depending on where you're aiming and firing. So you have to start to plan ahead to figure out, okay. This shot is great, but what am I going to do with my next bubble? Right. So I actually want to hit the game board in this direction to make it, or maybe a little bit less hard or a little bit harder to make it spin a little bit faster or slower to set yourself up for the next shot and the next shot and the next shot. So、um, that's what bringing the game into 3D meant to us. And it, and it works surprisingly well. It's actually a really neat subtlety to the original gameplay of Puzzle Bobble. And VR just plays into that. As well. All of the motion in VR is completely 3D. We wanted people who have never played a video game before to be able to pick up the motion controllers on an on a Oculus Quest or now on a PS Move and really be able to just dive into it without having to learn a bunch of complicated button presses and stuff. So it's a lot like aiming and firing a slingshot. You just pull your hands back, you can aim independently with either hand, and off you go. It's super fun. Nice. So then going back to the VR versus 3D aspect of it all. So, Puzzle Bobble VR for the Oculus Quest released just a, over a month ago. And, and now we're you know, talking about Puzzle Bobble 3D and, and you know, it being on consoles and PlayStation. What's the difference between Puzzle Bobble Vacation Odyssey VR and Puzzle Bobble Vacation Odyssey 3D? Well, there are a few differences. Anyone who's looking to get into this for the first time on consoles, they're going to notice a massive visual upgrade that we think people are going to be really happy with. But Beyond that,、uh, the, the really, really exciting addition for us, the thing that we've been spending the majority of our efforts on, is making the game playable in traditional formats, meaning not in VR. It's so cool. You get to see Bub fully in, in 3D. He's in the third person.、Um, he and Bob are passing bubbles back and forth and interacting <laughs> with one another. Like, It's just such a thrill for us to have both of these characters in fully realized 3D. It's, it's awesome. Nice. And, and, and Bub didn't have any complaints about being in high def, I see. So, <laughs> as long as we provided him all the green MMs he could eat, he was good to go. <laughs> Got it. Got it. That makes a lot of sense. So, then I guess closing out this segment, do、uh, either of you have anything else you'd like to share with fans about Puzzle Bobble 3D? 
Yeah, sure. Look, we're really excited for our PlayStation audience to play it in VR and for our VR fans to play the game on console so we can bring Bub and Bob to everybody. So keep an eye on all of our social pages and we'll see you out there. Awesome. Well, uh, we do have a little bit more time. So we're uh, going to take a couple of questions from uh, the Taito and uh, Servios Twitters. So uh, this first question is for Taito. What inspired the, the current look for Bub and Bob? え、本作のデザインはパズルボブルジャーニーやニューパズルボブルのデザインを元にしているんですけれども、このデザインを3Dかするのは初めてだったので、え、バブルの意見も取り入れつつ、タイトチームで何度も監視を重ねていきました。結果とてもいい表情豊かな元気で可愛さのあるモデルになった自信があります。僕のそう思う。なお、元となったニューパズルボブルのデザインは、え、色々な島を冒
And then I promised you guys that uh, we might have a special performance. We definitely do have a special performance um, in celebration of uh, 35 years of Puzzle Bobble and Bob's 35th birthday next month. Uh, we're very excited to be able to present an exclusive performance by Zuntada, uh, who created the original music for, uh, for the Puzzle Bobble games. So sit back, relax, and uh, enjoy. はい、この後はですね、元ズンタタのメンバーであるコシオによるパズルボブル、バブルボブルの BGM をリミックスした DJ パフォーマンス。そしてそれに続きまして、我々タイトーサウンドチームズンタタによるスペシャルステージをお送りしたいと思います。えー、我々ズンタタのライブステージの方はですね、ズンタタの代表曲でもある、えー、曲、ニンジャーウォーリアーズのダディマルクをお聴きいただきたいと思います。どうぞお楽しみください。お楽しみください。